even on cotton. Make ironing easier with Comfort Easy Iron. Now, keeping you up to date, the latest news from around the world, we join ITN for the ITV News Headlines. A British rescue team is now at the site of the crippled Russian nuclear submarine Kursk, but even as they arrived, the Russian Navy said there was almost no hope that any of the 118 crew would be found alive. Officials now say most were probably killed when the vessel sank almost a week ago. What little hope remains for the Russian crew has been pinned on the newly arrived British and Norwegian teams. They're expected to begin a rescue attempt in the next few hours. Four people have been injured after a shootout between rival paramilitaries in Belfast. Witnesses said masked gunmen opened fire during a loyalist parade on the Shankill yesterday. None of the four are said to have been seriously hurt. Last night, several houses in the area were attacked, and the RUC confirmed its officers had also been called to the scene of another confrontation in North Belfast. Charlton are top of the English Premiership after beating Manchester City 4-0. Chelsea beat West Ham 4-2 at Stamford Bridge. Meanwhile, Arsenal lost 1-0 at Sunderland, and Liverpool beat Bradford by the same score. Elsewhere, Spurs beat Ipswich 3-1, Leeds beat Everton 2-0, Middlesbrough won at Coventry 3-1, while there were draws between Derby and Southampton and Leicester and Aston Villa. In Scotland, Rangers won 4-1 against Dunfermline and Celtic beat Hearts 4-2. Well, that's all for now. I'll be back with more news later. Now, a case of friends and enemies becoming confused. When there's no one you can trust, you can only rely on your own mental and physical resources. Charles Bronson is St. Ives.